Hello everybody. Welcome back to How to Build a B-1 Bomber. Boy, I sure hope they'd load that movie I just made. It's 11 minutes long, so there's a, there's a chance they won't load it. They'll say it's too long. But we'll give you a recap what I did. I thickened me up some epoxy, and I, I ran out of micro balloons, so I'm going to show you another little trick. Plain old baking soda works just great. But I made me a little pastry bag, and I went around where my ladder's going to be and where my gear door's going to be. Then I painted my resin on there and smoothed it all out and uh, put a layer of fiberglass on there. Now, I'm going to put another layer of fiberglass. on a taper, try to save a little material, and get two pieces out of one. Well, oh, it was right the first time. camera there fellas okay you know I was looking on my channel insight the other day and I'm just amazed at all the subscribers I got and everything but you know only four percent of them is women four percent so we're gonna have to do something to raise that a little bit to a little skin <laughs> If there ain't many women into building model airplanes. All right. Now, I put that first coat of resin on there pretty heavy. So actually, we just got to smooth it out. Let me get that squeegee. Well, what did I do with my squeegee? Oh, darn it. Oh. There it is right there. Now yeah, let's just squeeze this around. We've got to be careful not to squeeze you too hard where we got our uh, filler. We'll end up with a void if we push all that out. I'm putting a total of three layers of glass on this. And we really got to make sure that glass is saturated. And we can pull the extra resin out later. Right now we just want to get that glass really saturated. Some, someone asked me if we used uh, metal rollers to get the bubbles out. You know, I made my first mold, I made out of that uh, fiberglass mat, and I really had to roll that, but with this cloth, I really don't have any air bubble problems. So, to answer your question, no, I don't use a roller. But I haven't really needed to either, so. Okay. Get all this laying flat. See them air bubbles come right out with the, the squeegee.
Well, tell you what, them big old scissors, they've been the best pair of scissors I ever owned. You know, if it, these things get glued together, I just kind of drop them on the floor and break them apart and take my X-Acto and a razor and clean them up, and they're good as new. But that's pretty much it, folks. There ain't much to this. It's just taking the time to do it. You know, I told everyone I was going to try that vacuum infusion. You know, and I think there's just going to be a learning curve with that. That's something I might mess with a little later. But I think for now, I don't have the time and the expanse part of uh, scrapping a bunch of parts. You know, it costs money to throw stuff away and... I just want to work, do what works best for me, you know. And there's other pe stuff works better for other people, and some stuff works better for me. And you know, I'm not saying this is the right way to do everything. All that I'm saying is this is what works best for me. Okay. Got that done. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to paint another coat of resin on there and put another layer of cloth and put my peel ply on there. And then I'm going to let it set up and uh, glue these two halves together. I'll make another movie when I glue these two halves together. So you can see how that's done. It's pretty simple too. And then, I'll make another movie when I pull this mold apart. I want you guys to see every step of this process. But, then after we get this nose done, I'm going to lay up the tail section. And, uh, so we can keep chugging. we got to keep chugging forward. And, uh, get to get this thing finished. And then when we have all our parts, bam, this will just go together fast and that's what we have to because we got we got a deadline we're going to meet and uh, we're going to have this thing flying so until tonight when i make another video i'll make another movie tonight and uh we'll hit you guys at three yesterday three tonight bam that's six movies in a few days this ought to make y'all happy a little bit anyway but I'm going to keep chugging. I decided this is it. I'm just going to chug forward just as fast and as hard as I can and uh, try and get this thing done. And I sure appreciate everybody. And uh, we will see you this evening. Guess where? In the shop. <laughs>